Hi and welcome back to another Tech Minds video. So today we're going to be taking a look at the Air Spy HF Plus Discovery. Now this is a brand new SDR receiver that's just been sent to me by Air Spy and we're going to take a quick look at it to see what it can do. So this is the box that it comes in. Uh, you can see it's, actually, it's not a very big box. So the product itself is probably not going to be very big but let's, uh, let's have a quick look. We've got some uh, specifications uh, on the side of the box here. So we've got HF coverage between 0.5 kilohertz up to 31 megahertz, then covers VHF between 60 and 260 megahertz, uh, 110 dB blocking dynamic range in HF, 95 dB blocking dynamic range in VHF. We have some high performance pre selectors for HF and VHF and uh, even for FM as well up to 660 kilohertz alias and image free output for 768 KSPS IQ. It also has 0.5 ppm high precision low phase noise clock adjustable to one PPB. So there you go, I've read the specs off the side of the box. Now what's also on the box on the other side is a block diagram. This is quite interesting because I don't see other manufacturers doing this, but this is uh, I always find these quite interesting. Uh, they're pretty much always sort of very similar, but as you can see here we've got the antenna coming in, we have a high pass uh, filter, uh, then we've got three low pass filters for, for the different bands. Uh, it goes through uh, stepped AGC. We then have the tuners for uh, the different bands. So we've got HF, band two and band three. Through an IF amplifier and filter. Through here it says a complex ADC, uh, analog to digital converter, 18 bit DDC, then the mic controller, then obviously off to your USB connection. So let's take a look and see what's, uh, what's inside the box. Well, obviously, the first thing we're going to see this is the S by HF Plus Discovery, and we also get the USB cable. So there you go, and that's what's in the box. Let's take a little closer look at the S by HF Plus Discovery itself. So this is what it looks like. You can see it's quite a small SDR receiver. It's got the uh, information about the product on the top. It's very thin as well, which is quite nice. Uh, on one end, we have the USB connection. So this would uh, be using this cable uh, off to your uh, computer. Uh, and then on the other end, we have obviously the SM8 female connection, uh, which is where you're gonna plug your, plug your antenna. There's a couple of little holes here. Uh, now I know that this one here, this is a, a, an LED, like a status uh, LED to show that it's getting power. Anyway, let's go ahead and just plug this in. First thing I wanna do is just, uh, just put an adapter on. So that's now connected off to my HF antenna. Now I just need to plug the USB cable in. And there we go, that's uh, that's the AirSpy plugged into the computer. Uh, as I mentioned before, there's a little LED here. It's kind of showing yellow on the video, but it's actually uh, kind of uh, orangey, amber kind of color. And, uh, and that's it, that's connected. Now, the antenna that I've got this connected to is uh, connected to an N-fed half wave, uh, which covers 80 through, all the way through to uh, six meters. Um, and it's tuned on each band. So now it's plugged in to the antenna and to the computer. Let's load up the software and see what we can do with this device. Now, before we take a closer look at the software, I just wanted to explain what an SDR receiver is for those that are either new to the channel or new to the hobby or maybe both. So an SDR receiver such as this, the S by HF Plus Discovery, is a device which connects to your computer, normally via USB, and it allows you to listen to radio signals and also have a visual representation of those signals on your screen. Now, in this slide, we can see a common setup when using an SDR receiver. On the left, we have an antenna Antenna, which then connects to your SDR receiver and then we have the SDR receiver itself in this case it's the AirSpy HF Plus Discovery and then we run some SDR 
receiver software on the computer. So in this case, I'm using SDR Sharp. Now specifically for this slide, the antenna is a wired dipole designed for listening to frequencies below 30 megahertz. The SDR receiver in the middle there is an S by HF Plus Discovery. And as mentioned before, the software that we're running on the computer is SDR Sharp. Now SDR Sharp is actually made by the same company that uh, manufactures the Air Spy, which is absolutely great. So they work very well together. Now I do have a beginner's guide to software defined radio if you're interested or it's all new to you. So please go and check out one of my previous videos. It's called beginner's guide to software defined radio. And I'm sure that'll give you a better understanding. Okay, so let's go ahead and have a little look at uh, SDR Sharp and see this S by HF Plus Discovery in action. So once you've got your S by HF Plus Discovery plugged into a USB port, you've got an appropriate antenna, load up your SDR Sharp software, and we're gonna to need to select the source. So over in the top left hand corner of the screen, you will see a little source tab, click the drop down, and you should see S by HF Plus. Just select that, and then what we're gonna do, we're gonna click the little play button just above, and that will then start the SDR Sharp software communicating with your S by HF Plus Discovery. Now the receiver within the HF Plus Discovery is extremely sensitive and that's because it has a whole new improved architecture. Now if you want to know more about this then you can go over to airspy.com, have a look at the HF Discovery uh, dedicated page and you'll be able to find a whole load of really interesting information about what they've done to this particular product. Now at the moment I'm tuned into the 40 meter handband so we're on 7.184 on lower sideband. Let's have a little listen to hear what it sounds like. Now there is a whole host of things that you can do obviously with SDR radio and this video is not really to cover everything that you can do with it. It's really just to kind of, you know, showcase the new S by HF Plus Discovery. Um, as you can see on the screen here, we're just doing a, a quick uh, demonstration of decoding some DRM. So it's a digital signal on 15.144 uh, megahertz and uh, using a program called Dream. I'm outputting the audio from SDR Sharp and uh, chucking it into Dream and Dream is decoding it. And I think one of the useful experiments that I think would be quite good would be to compare this particular product uh, against another product, similar product, and uh, do a comparison of receive. So I'll, I'll save that for another video. I'm quite impressed with it so far uh, with the amount of time that I've had to play around with it. And the size of it is, uh, is remarkable. Obviously, it has a single SMA antenna connection and just a USB connection, so it makes it very easy and portable. Obviously it doesn't cover up into the gigahertz region uh, like the S by Mini, etc. But for an HF SDR receiver, it's uh, really small and nice and pocket sized. Anyway, if you like the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. You can also check out my Twitter page. Uh, I'll leave a link down in the description where you can go ahead and follow me. I'm looking forward to playing around more with the uh, HF Plus Discovery and uh, hopefully we'll, uh, we'll get some more videos and do some comparisons so that you can see. Anyway, have a great rest of the day and I'll see you in the next video.